Welcome to the fourth episode of our onboarding video series to help you get started with Google AdSense. In this episode, we'll be focusing on the reporting functionality on AdSense. Reports in AdSense are designed to give you insight into your account performance. They include charts and tables so you can view trends and compare important metrics. The pre-made performance overview report lets you quickly check your earnings. No matter which report you'd like to look at, it's important to know what those metrics mean for your performance. Let's start with a brief overview of the metrics. Page views are what Google counts in your reports every time a user views a page displaying Google Ads. We will count one page view regardless of the number of ads displayed on that page. An impression is counted for each ad request where at least one ad has begun to download to the user's device. Impression RPM is the average earnings per 1,000 impressions. An impression is considered a viewable impression when 50% of the ad's pixels are on screen for at least one continuous second. Estimated earnings is the close estimate of your recent account earnings. However, this doesn't reflect the potential deductions that might be refunded back to the advertisers. The pre-made performance overview report lets you quickly check your earnings. It shows you your entire earnings broken down by date. And by default, it shows your estimated earnings for the last seven days. It can be used as a standalone report, or you can make changes to its breakdowns, metrics, and filters, and save it as a new report. The Sites report displays data for sites in your site list, including estimated earnings, page views, and more. The Countries report shows your performance broken down by the country of the visitors who have viewed the ads on your site. The Ad Units report lets you see the monetization performance of all your ad units. You can use the filter to limit the data to specific ad units. The Ad Formats report lets you understand how the different types of ads on your site, for example, native in-feed ads versus standard display ads, are performing. You can use the breakdowns to slice your report data by certain attributes, such as ad format, country, or date. Lastly, you can create, save, and schedule custom reports to help you keep track of how things change over time. Thanks for watching our video about reporting. We hope you found it useful and enjoy the rest of the series to help you onboard as quickly as possible. Click on the link to watch our next episode on how to optimize your AdSense account.